Hello children. Today I am going to teach you how to draw DC motor. Draw vertical line 9.5 cm of length. Then draw another line parallel to this. Mark 0.5 from the top of this line. Again from that point mark 3 cm now you have to draw two magnetic poles on the either side so keep 5.5 at the middle so that you can draw either side a straight line from here to here 4 cm again from 7 cm to 11 cm so that you can identify here it comes around 3 cm in the middle after that you have to do the same here in the bottom where 3 cm is marked from 1 to 4 7 to 11 then draw an arc so that it look like concave magnets so here is the powerful magnet N and S now draw a horizontal line here again draw a horizontal line draw another perpendicular line here join this so same way you do it one more line inside so that it appears as if it is a rectangular coil yes. now from here mark 2.3 cm and 3 cm Draw a dumbbell shaped structure here, before that you erase in between. Then draw a dumbbell shape like this and join these two lines. Okay. Now one longer line and a shorter line then again a longer line same thing on the other side longer line here yeah, longer line another one is shorter line now it's easy look this one this is brush okay Then draw a line this side and either another side. Then complete this. Then you have to draw battery, longer line and a shorter line. Longer line and a shorter line. Here longer line indicates positive terminal of the battery shorter line indicates negative terminal of the battery now after this you complete this then here you have to draw to the line indicates the coil connected to the split rings so that you have to erase Then you have to make this full ring as split ring by drawing two lines. Look how it appears as if it is cut into half. Now from here 
you have to join this line so this shows the rectangular coil is joining to the split ring now you have to mark see how to mark always you should remember in the first lesson you have learned that from the positive terminal of the battery always electricity will flow the conventional direction so from positive terminal of the battery you have to mark arrow mark towards negative terminal of the battery look at this so here it completes now you have to mark rectangular coil a b c d okay here is two split rings that is s1 s2 here are two brushes b1 and this is axle a and these two are powerful magnets hope you all understood this